Hey guys, today I'm going to do something a little different from DVDs. Um, basically because I got this new product and I'm in love with it. So I thought I'd do like a mini review. Because when I was buying it, I was looking for reviews online. And there wasn't anything like from... There wasn't really anything from, from like regular users. They were just from like companies and promos and stuff. So I thought it'd be cool for those who might be interested in buying one. But it's... um. It's a Logitech Squeezebox Boom. Basically, it's a network music player. So, it will play basically all the music that you have on your hard drive or your computer, whatever. Um, and it's just awesome. I love it. And it's really cool. So, I thought I would just show you it. This is the box, obviously. Uh, basically... It comes, I haven't prepared for this and I can't open the box, it comes with like a little carry case, other than that, basically what you see here, uh, this is the actual unit itself, excuse these things here, as you can see it's displaying the time there, this is just in standby mode, but um, whenever you want to play a track it will just wake up instantly, um, let me get the remote, okay this is the remote, it's pretty simple, um, and it sticks on top of here and it's magnetic as well um, sorry there it's magnetic so that's kind of cool um, but I usually keep it near me obviously so let's turn it on a sec so it's got now playing music library um, artists and it's got basically all your artists it will list there you can also search lifetime um, letter or artist name, act track name, whatever. At the moment, I've got something last track I listened to. Um, most deaf lifetime. This is definitely not going to be a partner video because I'm not allowed to play this music. Um, yeah. Um, let me show you how you set it up. So we're at the computer now. Basically, when you get the squeeze box, um, you want to enter in, enter in your like Wi-Fi connection. It will pick it up, um, and then you have to install Squeeze Center. We well, don't have to, but there's another thing you can use. But this is what I'm using. You can install Squeeze Center, and it will pick up your music. You can sync it to your iTunes, so it will pick up your music library. You can't organize your music within Squeeze Center. Which is a little bit annoying, but I prefer the iTunes organisation anyway. So, um, it'll even pick up playlists. I go into playlists there. It has all my iTunes playlists. It updates it whenever I update iTunes. Um, so, from here, you can play any track. So, let's just see that track I was playing here. Got play. Play. And I don't know if you can hear, but it's just instantly playing over there. You can also do playlists this way. Um, basically, when I'm on the computer, I usually just have that open and mess about in there instead of going through the remote. But you can have the squeeze box downstairs and you could be up here and you could pick a playlist and it will play downstairs. Um, it's all wireless, obviously. That's the point. The other great thing about the player is it um, can play like music um, radio stations from around the world. It also has music services. So another main thing was um, I use Last FM to track and scrubble all my music. This thing scrubbles straight off of the box, which is excellent. Um, like for example, let's carry on playing that tune. Go into my Last FM. This is my Last FM. Yes, my username is Humpitch if you want to add me <laughs> so I'm just going to refresh the page here um, oh, it's not showing it right now in a minute it will come up and it will say playing using squeeze box and here are my last listen tracks definitely get last FM if you don't know what it is it's amazing it squabbles all your music and puts them into charts and stuff it's awesome okay Let's pause that a minute. So that is basically Squeeze Center. Um, 
let's go back over to the box because it's far more attractive than the right, screen. So back over here just to show you an example of the radio, the internet radio. Hang on. Okay, where is it? So we got radio, you have staff picks, uh, local radio, you can search by genre, um, you can go to world. So let's have a look. Find a city, North America, uh, United States. I don't know, California, let's pick one, and it will connect in a minute, I don't have a clue what I'm connecting to right now. Right, so I'm connected to KHSU Public Radio, I have no idea. Playing some blues, that's just an example, let's go to... Go to Radio One. Let's play some Radio One. As you can see, it's playing the radio, and you can play any radio station. It's pretty epic. Um, the sound on this is insane. Like when I was reading reviews. Um. I was surprised by how many reviews were saying how amazing the sound is on this little box. Um, but I totally agree. I can't really show you what it's like really because the camera sound isn't that great. But believe me, deep bass um, goes as loud as you want without distorting. Or very, very little, minimal distorting. Um, it's really great. Other great things it does. Um, it's actually got a game. It's got like Tetris. I don't know if you can see that. Like, I don't have a clue what to do with that. It's got an alarm, you can wake up to your music every day. You can set it up on Squeeze Centre or on here, but on Squeeze Centre it's um, easier. Um, and you can like choose a different song to wake up to, or you can choose a playlist. And it will like ease in so it doesn't just blur out and wake you up. Um, oh yeah, I use the alarm quite a lot, it's really good. You can search through everything, let's go through a playlist um, you pay for us, go playlist It's streaming like 100 gigs of music at my fingertips. I've had it downstairs when like I've had friends round and they've all loved it, you know, they've all picked up the remote, gone, oh, I want to look for this track, this track. It's just, I was like, do I need this at first? You know, I'm quite happy listening to music through iTunes, but this has just really changed the way I do it and I absolutely love it. So yeah, we're back at Last FM now. As you can see, listening using Squeeze Box and listening to Lupe Fiasco, Go Go Gadget Flow. Um, yeah, definitely add me on Last FM if you're interested. I absolutely love Another this. Another thing is the settings down here. Um, really, you can tweak the settings. Um, it's got a great. You can change the way the titles are displayed on the screen. You can you can mess with everything with the player. You can you know how it um, syncs with iTunes. Um, you can just mess around with the settings a lot. It's really okay. So this thing's gonna set you back about two hundred pound. I actually got it on Amazon. I got fifty quid off. I had a voucher. I think that's run out now. Um, Amazon even went down to £104 at one point, but I know it's back up now. Um, but if you ever get a deal on this thing, I totally recommend it. It's worth there every penny. squeeze boxes in the range. This is the squeeze box boom, um, which basically means it's got the speakers. You get the basic sque squeeze box, which you have to hook up to like your own sound system, I believe. I think it's about 50 quid cheaper. I would say definitely um, these bad boys are worth it, this whole system is. 
There's also the squeeze box duet, which um, has like a remote. It's got like cover art and everything on it. You can walk around the house and change what's playing from where, from wherever you are, really. That might be something I'd look into in the future. Be cool to have more than one of these, but that's just being greedy. So. I apologise that this review's been all over the place. I'm not used to reviewing things or <laughs> things other than DVDs. Um, it could be a lot more structured, but I just hope that maybe swayed someone's decision if they were wondering whether to get this. Definitely recommended by me. Love this thing. Um, yeah. Thank you for watching.